All right, we're here at the CN Tower. This time it's the daytime and I'm with Julian. Hello. All right, we are here at the famous iconic- We were here last week. Here, let's just- So again, this is daytime. I'm not gonna film much of this part. There's the turning red thing right there. But... Oh, yep, we got pictures. And they got a Lego CN Tower right here. Where? Right. Right here. This time it's all colored. I can't remember. I don't think it was last time. And there's no lineup. It's a Friday afternoon. And look at that panel they got. Alright, we're going on the purple elevators right away. There are your series three fixtures. Yeah. Probably about a minute up. You'll have the glass panel below your feet as well as on the door. If you're interested in Skypod and you have your Skypod, you can just check yep. out Skypod. Yep. Yep. Alright, thank you so much. Alright, it's just us in here. Looks like it's just us, yeah. Here we go. Yep, here we go. 114 stories high up. And you can look under there too. This is awesome. I love that we actually got it to ourselves. You see the doors? Looks like they replaced the indicator on And the fixtures too. Here. Yeah, mm -hmm. the buttons are different. See some of downtown. You can see all the way down there. Words can't describe how cool that is. Oh, look at that. This is out east. Mm hmm. The lake. Yep, you can see Lake Ontario and the islands in there. I think we're almost there. Yep. Here we are. Here we are. No floor passing chime. Oh, oh I take it back. <laughs> Here we are. Here we are. Hi, how are you? Alright, thank you so much. Oh, look where we are. <laughs> there goes the door. And we came right where the glass floor is. So, when I was here at night, the view just did not look this clear. Like, look at this. This is probably the nicest view I've ever seen. See, I think that's the Niagara Escarpment. That's like the East End, Scarborough. That's Scarborough over there. That's an amazing view. So, this is, I believe that's Tommy Thompson Park. Yep. See, that's Tommy Thompson Park right there. And then you can get a view of downtown right here. Skyline of Yonge Street is never gonna end. Yeah, you can see that's North York City Center. You can even see the 401 and the traffic on it. Oh my god. Really? Yeah. That's interesting. So you can see the Don Valley Parkway, the bluer Danforth Viaduct right there. Don Valley, Don River. See, that's up by Bayview Avenue and Highway 401. And again, if you look closely, wherever I keep going, that's the 401 right there. It's amazing. Residential areas here in downtown. You can see the Royal York. You can see the Oak Ridges Moraine a bit. And if you look right there, you can see the GO train and you can see the UP Express right there.
wherever it went. Oh, it went under the tunnel. There it is. And you can see a streetcar down there. That's the UP Express. You can see the Gardner Expressway. There's the wind turbine at the exhibition place. Humber Bay. Over there's Mississauga. I think that's Mississauga. Yep, that's Mississauga. That, I believe, is Downview's Airport. Or Downsview Airport, sorry. But I could be wrong. Not sure. See, again, this is like a really nice, like, the windows being so wide here. Uh, I don't think I could see Niagara Falls. But here's the Billy Bishop Airport. You can see Pickering over there. The Pickering nuclear plant, I believe that's it. See, that's about where the bluffs are. And up there, that's the hospital I was born at. Toronto East General Hospital, now known as Michael Guerin Hospital. See, this yes. is interesting. Before they used to have just a call button, but now they yes, have so, so before we used to like be inside and then we do it inside, uh, but because of the pandemic, so now they install the panel from outside. Yeah. So that's interesting. They did this in the operator. Yeah. Currently, the, this one shuts the floor from off, here. But yeah, you can select the floor from the outside with this panel if it's turned off. It's pretty neat. We need to go off the sky pod oh, now. New indicator on the outside. Yep. Alright. Alright, so I'm sending you 33 more floors from this level, or a total of 147 floors from the ground. Okay, so enjoy, see ball. you later. Thank Bye you. Now. And there she's going to close from, from out yep. there, which they added after the pin bullet. Welcome. We are traveling through the core of the CN Tower at 11 kilometers per hour towards Skypod, the highest observation in the Western Hemisphere. When you step out of the elevator, look up. The large plumb bob hanging from the ceiling is still. It's the tower that's moving. Please keep your hands clear of the door and watch your step as you exit the elevator. Bienvenue. Nous nous déplaçons au cœur de la tour CN, à une vitesse de 11 km par heure vers la nacelle, le plus haut point d'observation de l'hémisphère ouest. Lorsque vous sortirez de l'ascenseur, regardez au-dessus de vous. Le grand fil à plomb suspendu au plafond est immobile. C'est la tour qui bouge. We are. Veuillez we garder are. vos mains loin de la porte et faire attention à la marche. Hello, welcome everyone. Right at this side of the staircase. Oh, thank you. When you're ready to exit, just come back down on the other side. Okay. Otherwise, enjoy everyone. And here we are. Here we just got off. Pop. Right there. And here we are at the sky pod. Oh, God. Wow. <laughs> One way. Okay. See, look how low these. We're now 147 stories in the sky and 1,500 feet. Look at this. Wow. There's a plane landing for all aviation for plans. Bishop, yeah. For fans, there we go. There it is. Just landed, and there's where Julian came out of. And obviously, if you're watching this, use some common sense, people. Okay, still can't see Niagara Falls, but again, there's another view of Tommy Thompson Park, which there's is where the crowded highway. Yep, the Gardner Expressway. So that is where my bike broke down at that point right there. Where? Kind of. I don't know if. Oh, I'm, in the tower. Yeah, where that tower is. Yes. And that's about five kilometers. Oh, so well, I think that was the thing that was moved that they, they said about moving this thing right here. Yeah. It's not moving right now, but yeah. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's supposed to symbolize whenever the tower sways, I think. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Very unique. Anything? Okay. 
So you can see the Western Hotel, Western Harbor Castle. You're looking practically straight down. Alex, you're gonna love this. This is the railway or the, the train museum in Toronto. Yep, down there. Yeah, we'll go there for sure. Okay, where's the city center? That's Scarborough City Center there. Where the mall is. Main part of downtown. And again, I'll go to the hospital where I was born at. You can see Union Station at Which is about. And the GO train is all the way down there moving. Where's the hospital I was born at? It's got to be here somewhere. Oh, there it is. East General. There's the new part that they built. Yep. First Canadian place, then come Montreal. There's the Intercontinental Hotel. There's the Ritz Carlton right there. Yep. There's CBC right there. And look at that, this is probably the cool view. Look at this right here. See, that's like the main part of the CN Tower. Yeah. That, now that's pretty cool, I never... How you can see the top of it. Yeah. Yeah, you can see the top of the main wow. observatory. But what we can see is Center Island, which is about, see that? Yep. See, that's Center Island or Centerville with the... And all the cars just look like toys from up here. Yeah. Hands. And I believe that's, again, that's Tommy Thompson Park where I, where my yeah. bike broke down. That's the southernmost part in Toronto you can get to, I believe. And there's a ferry, which I believe is taking you to the Centerville, Center Island. And there's the, the ferry, which is going to Billy Bishop Airport. Yep, over there. I rode that. So, Apparently we're 30 34 more floors up, I think she yep, said. We're a total of Although it doesn't really seem like that. Doesn't really seem like that though from here, but maybe the perspective is a little bit different when you're like looking something like that. Maybe yeah, but you can see, it's so cool, you can see the top of the main observatory. Which is neat, you never see that obviously. No. Um, and again, the Gardner Express, oh, there's a streetcar down there. Where are you seeing that? Right there, on uh, Queen's Key. That one has like ads all over it. Look at that, you're seeing the top of the streetcar, which you never see, holy. Or, or... That's interesting. You can see like all the technical stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah, see, and you see the perspective, and that's where the Raptors play, the Scotia Bank yeah. Arena. Used to be Air Canada Center, but. And another look at the Bloor Danforth Viaduct right there, and the Don Valley Parkway. Okay. There's right. Julian. We're gonna now nice head back view. Down. And Let's now we're heading back down. Yep, so there's those panels they added during COVID. There's the moving thing that indicates if the tower sways, yeah. Yeah, which is pretty cool. And here it is. Here it is. <laughs> This floor, I believe, is closed. Yeah, that's the um, outdoor observation. Thank you. Thank you. And there goes the doors. Welcome we back. back we hope everyone enjoyed the view from the sky pod. We are traveling 11 kilometers per hour toward the outdoor terrace level. Once there, please feel free oh, to enjoy the open air on the terrace and explore the glass floor. Descending elevators can only be accessed from the outdoor terrace level. Please keep your hands clear of the door and watch your step as you exit and enjoy the view. Bienvenue. Nous espérons que vous avez tous apprécié la vue depuis la nacelle. Nous nous déplaçons à 11 km par heure vers le niveau de la terrasse extérieure. Une fois sur place, n'hésitez pas à profiter du plein air sur la terrasse et à explorer le plancher de verre. 
Les ascenseurs qui descendent ne sont accessibles que depuis le niveau de la terrasse extérieure. Puis gardez vos mains loin de la porte et faire attention à la marche en sortant de l'ascenseur. Et profitez de la vie. Oh, it's expired apparently. Yeah, it's expired. <laughs> Oof. What, what year does it say? says it expired just about a week ago. Ah, oh, a lot of it was here. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and that's a wrap. <laughs> yes. Here we go. All right, and now we're going on a more crowded elevator. Well, we'll be at the very front at least. Have a good day, everyone. This will take you straight down to the gift shop. Thank you. Thank you. This one still is at some of the Series 3 buttons. Alright, here we go. We. This is viewing north. Yep. You see Young Street. Oh, right by the end of the corner. Thank you for visiting the CN Tower. Almost here. Tallest glass elevators in the world. Ah. Here we are. And we're in the gift shop. Okay, so here we. Here, I guess I'll go out the small one. Here we are at the end of the tower. These are the gates you And there it is. And there are people up there. There are and there's the tower itself. There are people on the edge walk. Look at that. Sorry. And well. Wow. Okay. That is gonna be so. It. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. That's it. See you guys. There's Julian. Say bye. Bye.